listening to growing up? Were they some of your major influences? My best friend's dad, Jimmy B.B. King, who I love, like, I, think I really respect him as a musician. Ben Howard was introduced to me by one of my friends. Um, and so a lot of it has been through friendships instead of actual family life. Okay. Uh, so my so musical, later Yeah, it was, it was a lot later. Okay. You describe your music as mainstream, though. Yeah. What um, other artists of that genre would you love to perform with or make a record with? Bombay Bicycle Club would be amazing, mm -hmm. like absolutely awesome. Another person, Ben Howard, just because his guitar playing skills is incredible. Uh, John Mayer for his musicality. Your EP is coming out soon. Yeah, it is, finally. Tell me about it. Now it's eventually finally coming out, which is really exciting. Yeah. Um, we've got the final artwork for it, uh, so it's called Lost and Bewildered. Lost um, and Bewildered. Yeah, all the, all the songs are recorded now, they're all produced. Um, Paul Stamber did a brilliant job on that. Um, and then, yeah, it's, it's like we're launching in September. How often do you write? So I write whenever the time kind of jumps on me. I feel I feel that forcing yourself to write will eventually just produce a song that feels forced. Most of my time I spend writing is very early in the morning. Oh really? Um, I think oh, in the that, middle of the night. Yeah. Do you have a favourite place to write? See, I can't. I kind of like um, in bed, half asleep. <laughs> I go to a seaside home up up in the north that my uncle has. It just seems to be inspiring. Yeah. It kind of feels silent yet really loud. It's it's. it's you are a poet, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> what or whom is the most unusual thing that's inspired your music or your writing? I think it was a cartoon actually. Really? Yes, it was. It was the first time I watched Adventure Time. Writing songs in those different genres can boost you as a musician. See, these guys, they just like sing about, you know, cooking bacon pancakes. <laughs> That's brilliant. That's alright. So yeah. What's your dream venue to play at? Union Chapel, definitely dream, dream venue. Okay. Um, I went to go and see Paper Aeroplanes there. Absolutely incredible. Okay. Great sound. When you get some good news, who's the first person you call? Um, so it'd be either my mum, my dad, my little brother, even though he doesn't pick up his phone ever. <laughs> the first song of the EP is called Poetry. Um, so basically that's about frustration within relationships and how you feel that lying within relationships becomes an art form. Uh, riddle is, it basically does what it says on the tin. Uh, it is a riddle. That was that was the one that was that was made at three o'clock in the morning. Okay. The last one is Neverland, which is, as I said before, you know, with the, with the cartoons, I kind of wanted to keep immature and childlike through my adulthood. Great. I look forward to listening to it. Yeah. Mountains come up, you and I will fall. His mountains.